Cop Biz. Hello everyone, this is Yash Saxena and you're watching Cop Biz. In this video, we are going to talk about the WPC certificate for import of Bluetooth headphones. The Ministry of Communication and Information Technology granted authorization for wireless planning and coordination, better known as WPC. In 1952, regional offices were built in Chennai, Mumbai, Kolkata, and Guwahati, in addition to the New Delhi headquarters. The WPC's objective are to observe and authorize over the frequency spectrum as well as to provide the necessary licenses for the communication equipment like radio. The wireless planning and coordination equipment type approvals, also known as WPC ETA, is necessarily needed to be obtained for the purpose of importation of any wireless device or product in India. The WPC certificate for import of Bluetooth headphones approval is authorized for issuance under the department of WPC. On the notification of the office, memorandum is issued by WPC Wing, Department of Telecommunication. Dot under the Ministry of Communication on 26 February 2019. It was declared that for certain wireless devices or products, a wireless planning and coordination equipment type approval or WPC WTA is not mandated further, but a self-declaration is to be issued for the specified wireless devices or products. This notification stated that for certain type of wireless devices or products, specifically wireless devices or products of bands with low transmission power that are also exempted from the importation license as per the requirement of the import policy issued by the Directorate General of Foreign Trade also known as DGFT were also exempt for issuance of a WPC ETA. The authorization of the requirements that are needed to be fulfilled falls under the regulation of the export and import policy also known as XM policy under the governance of Directorate General of Foreign Trade. The list of devices enlisted for self-declaration of WPC certificate for import of Bluetooth headphones, the WPC ETA clearance is to be issued via a self-declaration that is granted for commercial or finished wireless or Bluetooth device or product, specifically mobile phones and computer devices that operate as banned in accordance with the permission granted in India for the license that is exempted are mentioned as follows. Mobile handsets, smartphones, electronic notepads, laptops, smartwatches, short-range devices that include electronic accessories, microphones, speakers, headphones, etc. A self-declaration is mandated to be issued by the importer or by an authorized Indian representative also known as AIR that will suffice to be treated as a shred of evidence for grant of permission required for clearances by the Customs and Central Excise Authorities. Documents needed for self-declaration of WPC certificate for import of Bluetooth headphones which are mandatorily has to be drafted in the specific format as issued by the Department of Telecommunications under the governance of the Ministry of Communication. Details of the name and designation of the applicant, name, address and contact details of the importing and exporting company authorized seal and signature of the company, applicant, consignment port details from where the imported good is scheduled to arrive, the AWB number, the gazette notification number along with the date of when the official notification was issued. The list including all the details of the wireless devices or the products such as the name of the wireless devices or product, the model number of the each wireless device or product, frequency range of wireless device, the output of the wireless device or product, remarks regarding the product quality of the wireless devices. The test report issued by the BIS approved recognized testing and assaying laboratory details, the details of the BIS approved recognized testing and assaying laboratory of where the product testing is conducted, the payment receipt along with the payment date of the required fees required for ETA. Approval to be paid in accordance with the specifications provided by the WPC wing of the Department of Telecommunications under the governance of Ministry of Communication. Proof of details of submission of the consignment test, the test report, ETA approval fees, payment has been notified to the WPC. WPC and the Department of Telecommunication consent to the WPC department for sample testing and audits that are needed to be carried out for the purpose of monitoring and for RF analysis. These are the mandatory documents required for the certification. This process may take a lot of time. This is where COBIS rolls in. Our expert team eases up the process for you. If you are looking for any such license or registration, contact our expert team on the given numbers. For more such content, subscribe to our channel COBIS. Thank you.